unlock the device, we press the lock button for three seconds. And now we are in the expert menu and can adjust or set the device. Next to the lock symbol is the face, breathing face indicator, up for inspiration, down for expiration, and S or T for spontaneous and timed. Or displayed next to it the patient type. We can set the device to pediatric settings, S of 30 milliliter of tidal volume, and uh, to adult setting. And then the circuit type is displayed. Uh, you can use leakage circuits, single circuits with valve, double circuits, all circuits in 15 and 22 millimeter, and the double circuit even in 10 millimeter up to 50 milliliter of tidal volume. Um, next to it is the battery indicator. As long as the device is on mains, the capacity will be displayed in percentage, and after disconnecting the mains and uh, waiting for two till three minutes, then the remaining battery capacity is displayed in hours and minutes. On the upper right, we have the alarm mute button. This button has two functions. One is of course to mute alarms or cancel alarms. And the second function is if no alarm is emitted, we can mute the alarms in advance for two minutes. This might be helpful in case of uh, a cannula that needs to be changed or uh, when the airways needs to be suctioned. This function can be deactivated uh, by pressing the alarm mute button very briefly. On the right side of the display, we see the actual menu of Louisa, starting with the home button and the ventilation menu for the actual ventilation settings, the alarm menu for the alarm settings. Here we have a different views, uh, for instance, the documentary view, the curves and the mobility view or battery view. The report menu, in the report menu we will find the alarm list or event list or a combined alarm and event list. And uh, the last one is the system uh, menu. On the lower right, the touch lock is placed in case the device needs to be cleaned. And next to it, the key to access the uh, night view or the quick access of and the brightness settings of the display. Now, when more than one program is released for use, we can change the program directly here with this button. Start and stop of therapy is done here. On the left, while ventilation is administered, we see the most important measured values. In the middle, we have uh, our pressure bar graph or leakage system, and the uh, bar graph of the unintentional leak. And when measurements, SPO2 measurement or FI2 measurement is used, then these values are displayed below here in the display.